What's up, family? Welcome back to another video. Yes, yes, we are here in Stonecrest, Georgia again. I got two things I want to accomplish today. First thing is going to be to show you around a little bit of the park here, Arabia Mountain, show you the little boardwalk for a second, and then also take you over to a community here, Parks of Stonecrest. So we got some business to get into. Let's get started. All right, so if this is your first time on the channel, allow me to say hello and welcome you to the channel. My name is Raymond and I am a real estate broker here in Atlanta. I work with buyers and sellers that are looking to relocate to the area, as well as buyers and sellers that are already here in the area. So if you have any assistance that you need, uh, or if you need assistance in real estate, buying or selling, feel free to reach out to me. And if you are a frequent viewer or a subscriber, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for coming back. Um, so today we're hanging out here for the most part. I just want to show you kind of the, um, the prelude or the entrance to Arabia Mountain and show you the boardwalk area. This is a great park. Again, as I said in the pros and cons video, one of the beautiful things about living in Stonecrest is that you have access to a lot of outside hiking or outside trails or just being outside. All right, if you want to be outside, Stonecrest is where you should consider uh, living here in Metro Atlanta. All right, so I'm going to flip the camera around and show you that. And then we're going to go ahead and jump over to the parks of Stonecrest, which is a nice subdivision that I have a listing in. So I'm going to show you that, uh, but just also show you what the community feels like. So you have an example of what a community feels like here in the city of Stonecrest. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right, y'all, so this is the entrance to one of the parking areas. It's a small area that you can park, one of many. There's a lot of areas that you can park in here at Arabia Mountain, uh, but this is kind of where I'm sitting here. Uh, but this is one of the uh, entrances to where you can go on top of the mountain and you know continue to hike through it. Um, yeah, so this area here is more like, I think, the maintenance for the park, uh, the park rangers and stuff like that. Uh, when you come up to the entrance here, you will be greeted by the park map, the trail map. You can get a map of the trails and all of that stuff and learn some history about Arabia Mountain. Uh, but again, nature, nature, nature. If you're interested in nature, this is the park for you. All right. So uh, you should definitely come and explore, learn all you want to learn about the area. Really nice. I mean, especially uh, from a learning standpoint of like kids as well to learn more about nature. All right, so this is a quick little bit. You can pause this if you want of the map and showing you kind of how the trail system works here at Arabia Mountain. But like I said, man, in that pros and cons video, Stonecrest is truly all about outside living. Um, and they even give you some free sunscreen here to protect you, keep you from uh, developing any type of cancer from the sun. And then- All right, so you would just literally walk up Go ahead, go ahead and enter the trail. This rock is to keep people out on bikes and scooters and skates and things like that. They don't want you to bring that in, of course. Uh, but, but yeah, so you would just enter the trail system through there. I'm gonna just show you a little bit about what it looks like. Um, and yeah, so you can see it for yourself. But it's a, a great little trail uh, to come and hike. It's an alternative to Stone Mountain. Um, you know, it's almost like Stone Mountain, little sister. But uh, really, really nice place to come if you want to get that outdoor energy and trail vibe going. All right, so here you go. This is a little bit of the trail here, or the mountain, not the trail, but it, it goes. And we ain't we ain't doing no uh, no trails today. All right, <laughs> this is not what you' about to see. But it tells you how to you know hike on it and 
all that stuff. I mean, it's, it's a great opportunity to be outside. Um, and don't be a plant killer. I'm trying to encourage you not to step on plants and stuff. But, uh, but yeah, I think this is pretty much all I wanted to show y'all. It's a huge rock here. It feels like Stone Mountain truly here, but I mean, the elevation is a lot different from Stone Mountain, of course. But uh, same type of rock from my eyes. <laughs> uh, so yeah. All right, y'all, so it is hot out here. Let's go ahead and jump in the car and head over to the parks of Stonecrest. Let's go. So again, as I said today, we're hanging out here in Stonecrest, Georgia, uh, and this is a city that I have not covered yet. The pros and cons video was just released two days ago, so definitely go and watch that. You can click on the card or you can uh, wait to the end of this video and I'll put a uh, card there as well for you to go and check it out. All right, so definitely check that out to learn more about the area. But what I want to do today is take you inside of this community, parts of Stonecrest. All right, it's right here, right here, one of the entrances. This is a master plan community. Uh, price points ranging all over the place uh, in the, you know, low fours up into the 600s. The homes include basement lots here as well as slab uh, foundations as well. So there's a ton of variety here at the parks of Stonecrest. Also, one of the perks of the parks of Stonecrest is that it is completely amenitized. The amenities include swimming pool, tennis courts, playgrounds, as well as a clubhouse that you can rent for private events or events for your family, all right? The community features an array of architecture as it relates to the different layouts, floor plans, bedroom sizes. You can also find some really nice basement lots here as well. All right, I do have a listing in this community. Uh, I'll go ahead and link that video tour down below and we'll walk by that street and show you the house on the exterior as well. So to go inside of it, definitely go and watch that property tour link down below all right so again the purpose of my video is just to show you around a community here in stonecrest so that you can understand what it feels like here on the ground all right but it is a truly a beautiful community and it's so quiet every time you come here you're going to get this same quiet feel <laughs> but there are sidewalks and you know you'll see residents doing their evening walks or morning walks uh which is really nice and community oriented all right so without further ado let me take you around a little bit show you a few of the streets on the driving bit and then i'll go ahead and stop at my listing to show you the exterior and show you the lot um yeah and we'll put a wrap on today's video but the whole goal is to familiarize you more with stonecrest on the ground so that you can see it uh for yourself so without further ado let's get into it
all right y'all welcome 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 on to the ground with me behind the camera <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed that little riding bit it was a uh, pretty much the majority of the community that we went down there were maybe one or two streets that we missed but 80 percent was captured in that little uh, driving bit but one of the key features i would say about this community is that the homes are all unique in a sense although it's a production bill but like elevation is different uh, and they did a great job with making sure that they did not put the same color homes next to the same color home <laughs> if you will uh, so you had to kind of pick a different um, layout um, and uh, exterior rendering and color which gave the community a little bit more character in my opinion also this community does offer homes that have the three-sided brick option which my listing does have in here um, which I'm gonna get you to here in a bit so this is the uh, male kiosk here uh, for the neighborhood as well. But let's just walk up this street here for a moment just to kind of show you what I mean uh, by all of the differences and, and how it feels. Um, also, a funny thing about Stonecrest is that uh, it is. it used to be the city of Lithonia. Well, so for where we're standing now, it would be considered, it would have been considered unincorporated Lithonia. And what that means is essentially there was no city government here uh, for this particular area of Lithonia, which caused a lot of the residents to feel disenfranchised and wanted to create their own cityhood. And Stonecrest was incorporated and created. Um, and so that's how we got the city of Stonecrest a few years ago. Okay. It's been maybe about six, six, seven years now, I believe, uh, that the city has been incorporated. So it's still a new city in the sense of the city government and uh, the field and what's going on and uh trying to you know continue to uh cultivate the city but at the end of the day stonecrest is truly just a a city of residential um, with a little bit of anchoring of commercial with the mall that we saw uh in the pros and cons video okay but yeah so this is pretty much what you'll see here at the parks of stonecrest and i wanted to just kind of get you inside of the interior neighborhood here in stonecrest so what we'll do is i'll go ahead and walk you over to my listing as of today of this video it is still available so if you have interest definitely go and watch the property tour video which is in the video description of this video all right so as i said hopefully the wind isn't doing too much <laughs> i left my microphone in the office but hey we're gonna keep filming this is the mail kiosk as i said before for all of the homes here in the neighborhood so that's just to give you kind of the scale of the size of the community okay all right y'all so here is my listing coming into view it's going to be this one here with the fenced in backyard it is a corner lot three-sided brick four bedroom three and a half bath it was built in 21 2021 it comes in at a 2920 square feet one of the unique things about this layout is that it has the primary suite on the main level all right and then the secondary rooms are upstairs which are really big rooms so again if you want to see inside of this house go ahead and scroll down video description you'll see the link to where you can go and take a look at it it does also have the exterior lighting on the exterior of the home as well so at night it's really pretty and a lot of these homes do also have that exterior lighting too so that goes to the caliber of the uh neighborhood uh the homes and i think the people also have a general can you know like same mindset of let's take care of our neighborhood take care of our community which is really nice all right so that's that they have uh so yeah this is the front of the home uh, my clients are at, actually at home now, <laughs> uh, and I wasn't going to ask them to move no cars for no video, but here we go. This is it. If you want it, it is still available for sale. Uh, nice little distance also between the neighbors on, on this side. I mean, this is a subdivision, and so in Georgia, typically, your subdivisions are, aren't going to be super, super, super... Um, uh, like the production production neighborhoods are typically going to be a little bit closer anywhere from a third of an acre to up to a half in most cases and this one is more so a third of an acre okay uh but yeah so i hope you guys have enjoyed taking a look around stonecrest here all right um, y'all so i hope you enjoyed today's video if you have any questions about my listing here in parks of Stonecrest, feel free to reach out to me. All of my contact information is on the screen and can always be found in the video description below. Also, be sure to hit the subscribe button because more content about living in Stonecrest, Georgia will be coming up on the channel. So if you're interested either in the house that I just showed you, my listing or the community, hit the subscribe button and reach out to me if you have any questions. Until next time, take care of yourself and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.